What if I told you doctors could predict your illness before you got sick? What if a smartwatch could save your life while you're sleeping? And what if surgery could be done by a robot more accurately than a human hand? Welcome back to Tech News. My name is Karthik, and today we're diving into one of the most fascinating transformation of our times on how technology is completely changing healthcare as we know it. This isn't science fiction. This is happening right now in hospitals, homes, and even on your wrist. So stay with me because at the end of the episode, you'll see healthcare in a way you never have seen before. Let's start with the old health care versus the new. Traditional health care looked like patients see doctors after getting sick, long hospital wait and paperwork. One size fits all treatment and medical records locked in filing cabinets. Today, modern health care looks like illness predicted before symptoms even appear, virtual doctors visit from our couch, personalized treatment plans, health care data tracked in real time, and technology is the real reason for this shift. Artificial intelligence isn't replacing doctors. It's supercharging them. AI is being used in healthcare today by scanning thousands of medical images it detects cancer, stroke, or tumor earlier than human eye. In some hospitals, AI analyzes CT scans in seconds, helping doctors make life-saving decisions faster for more accurate diagnosis. AI systems can now analyze patient's history and predict heart attacks, sepsis, complications after surgery. Here's an example that I'd like to provide you. At major hospitals, AI tools are already helping radiologists detect breast cancers with higher accuracy than traditional screening alone. This means fewer misdiagnosis, earlier treatment, and more lives are saved. That's very powerful. Wearables and smart device is now part of our technology. Healthcare no longer lives in hospital. It lives on our wrist. It helps us track our heart rate, oxygen level, sleep, and stress. It detects irregular heart rhythm, alerts user to potential medical emergencies. But the life-saving example I will tell you is that smartwatches have alerted users with abnormal heart rhythm, leading them to seek medical help before a heart attack or stroke occurred. Here's another thing I'll tell you. Remote patient monitoring. Doctors can now monitor chronic patients from home, track recovery after surgery, and reduce hospital readmissions. This is especially life-changing for elderly patients with diabetes or heart disease. Healthcare is moving away from average treatment to your treatment, meaning treatment is based on your DNA. Medication is tailored to how our body responds. With fewer side effects, we get better outcomes. The real world impact is today when cancer patients receive therapies designed specifically for their genetic makeup. Certain drugs now work only for patients with specific genetic markers. This means more effective treatment, less trial and error, and faster recovery. Robots are now assisting surgeons, not replacing them, but enhancing the precision. Robotic surgery benefits from smaller incision, less blood loss, faster recovery time, and greater surgical accuracy. Robotic assisted surgeries allow surgeon to operate with millimeter level precision, reducing human error during complex procedure because how the technology is put in place. Patients recover faster and often leave the hospital sooner. Here's another thing that's a biggest shift in recent years. We now have telemedicine and virtual healthcare. We don't even have to go to a doctor's office anymore. If we're sick, Doctors tells us to telehealth and they see us in face-to-face -face 
via on screen. This helps for mental health therapy from home as well. And finally, it helps renew the prescriptions online. Why does this matter? Because rural patients get better access, busy professional saves time, and it reduces the healthcare cost. For many people, telemedicine has turned healthcare from a stressful task into a convenient experience. With innovation comes responsibility. Why? Data privacy, who owns the healthcare data? AI bias, is technology trained fairly for everyone? And over-reliance on tech, what happens when system fails? Technology must be secure, transparent, and human-centered because healthcare isn't just about data. It's about people. Here's my final thought. Healthcare is no longer just about treating illness. It's about predicting disease, preventing problems, personalizing care, and empowering the patients. The future of healthcare is smarter, faster, and more human than ever before. And the most exciting part, we're only getting started. If you enjoyed this episode, subscribe to my YouTube channel and Spotify tech news. Follow me on Facebook page. Let me know in the comment, would you trust AI with your healthcare? Thank you for listening. I'll see you next time. Stay healthy, stay curious. Thank you.